Hi there and welcome back to the Floss Marketing School. In this video we are going to see how you can uh, create a neurogram. I got this idea actually by reading the book of uh, Sarah Lacaz which is about uh, Scratch 3. So Scratch 3 is a platform in order to uh, teach IT to, um, to children. And um, so the typical use case of a neurogram is if you go to one of your customers and you would like uh, to show products such as this one as an hologram like this, uh, she or he will have the feeling that uh, the, the product is here uh, with her or him. And um, so it, it's very easy to do. Uh, you need two things. So you need to have a, a pyramid. So a pyramid is the thing that you can see over here. So you have many tutorials on the internet explaining you how to make a uh, pyramid. It's not that uh, difficult. All you need to do is just to have one plastic cover, exactly the same one that you use uh, when you are playing with your basic furniture. And then you need to design a pyramid such as this one where you cut, in fact, uh, the foundation in order to have it uh, stable that you can put on the screen of your tablet or on your smartphone. And uh, you need to have the right uh, dimension. So for example, on a 10 inch tablet, it's a 12 uh, centimeter basis that you need to have over here. Uh, it's, it's really straightforward to, uh, to create. And then you just add uh, some rubber uh, over here in order to make uh, the, the pyramid uh, complete, such as what we are seeing over here. Uh, then the second thing that you need is either a smartphone or either a tablet. And on this uh, app or on this website that you're going to create for your tablet or for your app, you need to have four images such as the one that you can see here. And as you can see, they are all uh, opposite to each other. And here you keep either a blank or either a, a black space. And then this is where you insert your pyramid. In fact, the images are going to be reflected on the pyramid and uh, we'll uh, show it on the on the middle. And of course, it's better when instead of images, you have uh, animation. OK, so uh, now I'm going to move back uh, to my uh, to my camera. So right now you can see my camera. So on my camera, I have my pyramid that I created, which is uh, over here. And here I have my tablet. And on my tablet, what I did is I went um, on the Play Store and I downloaded an app which had already those uh, videos in. Um, just because I didn't have the time actually to create uh, one by myself. And as you can see, if I'm launching one of the app of this, uh, one of the video of this given app, I have the feeling that the Medusa is, is right here. Okay. And I can, in fact, like this, uh, change and put whatever I want. You know, I do what it is. Okay. And here you have the feeling that this is with us. So it's kind of, uh, it's kind of fancy. Uh, it's kind of funny as well to do. And uh, so you can, let's go for this one. Um, let's see how it looks like. And okay, but it's going to get bigger and bigger. And uh, yeah, it's kind of fun. So uh, feel free to, uh, to create it. It's really straightforward. It's just going to take you, let's say, like, uh, like one hour. The most difficult part is really to have the foundation, which are uh, really stable of your pyramid. And then the next thing is about um, designing the app. Uh, so you can really use different, uh, different things in order to, to do that. For example, like uh, giving it to try with App Inventor 2, even if it's kind of difficult to move the element. So you can probably create a, a, an hybrid app or even uh, use a, a website in order to design this, um, this. And then have your own kind of portfolio of all your product that you go directly to your customer and show them how they will look uh, in real. And that's it uh, for today. So as an exercise, just try to create your own hologram, your own pyramid, and have fun with it. And more thanks for watching our video. And do not hesitate to create your own and share them on social networks.